thank you for watching. In this video, I'm going to unbox and review Barbie Looks number 19. Now, this one I'm really excited about because it is a mix and match gift set. Let's take a closer look. This is the shipper for Barbie Looks number 19 mix and match color block. So let's get the shipper open. So it doesn't look like it's gonna be the kind I have to tear open, fortunately. So I'm just gonna rip it open at the top. There we go. And hmm, we've got some tissue paper going here. Very nice, but I don't know if I can, yeah, pulling it's just going to tear. So I'm going to do a wiggle, wiggle, and a shake, a shake, a shake. There we go. So let's see. I want to see what this box looks like. I'm very curious to see. Ooh. Really cool. So I'm going to go in that we can see. The doll some very nice here. And we've got multiple outfit pieces. Very good. I want to see what the box side looks like. Okay, so we've got the model number 19 on the side that goes along with the branding. And of course, we've got the looks there. Very cool. And then, of course, they show us all the different types of looks that you can get with this doll. Very cool. I'm seeing some outfits I'm already liking here. So let's go down so you can see what it says here. And if you want to pause the video in order to read what this says, go ahead and do that. But make sure you come on back. So I am going to actually, let's just get this box open. I mean, it's really pretty. I love all the colors and everything, but I want to see what's it doing here. So let's See if I can get this open. I don't want to totally wreck this box. Let's see if we can get her out. Yes. All right. Here she is. Now, you know, these are some really interesting eyebrows for a Barbie doll. I like them. They're different from what you typically see. And honestly, it's just kind of nice to see some different stuff so yeah, i gotta get used to that a little bit but i actually like it's just it's a, this is a really different look and that's one of the things that i love about barbie looks barbie looks seems to be more you know different and more geared towards adult collectors so i see a pair of shades in there and a clutch purse and some bracelets a doll stand that top and skirt and of course looks like we've got two pairs of shoes. Oh, and she's got another clutch in her hands here. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to remove this doll from the liner so that we can take a look at all the pieces that come with her and, of course, take a closer look at this doll. This is a close-up of Barbie Looks number 19. Her face sculpt is Lena. Lena is back in the line again. I think this may be her third time in the line. Very cool. Now, one of the things I must say, just looking at her, and I'm actually gonna pull it back for a second, just looking at all the colors. She's really reminding me of Billy Boy's feeling groovy Barbie from back in the days. It's a, kind of like she's like a nod or kind of an updated interpretation. I don't know, but I'm loving it. That being said, another thing that I really want to get, I'm really excited about is actually the bangs. Now, Mattel's had a history for years of not always getting those bangs right. And I would, must say these are probably some of the best bangs that I have seen from Mattel in years. Absolutely beautiful. She is really, really gorgeous. And she's really a very different look for Barbie. And I'm all in for it. I want you to just see the screen. It looks like I need to wipe her face just a a little bit, but this is how she came out of the box. And I always try to show you what they look like out of the box. So I'm gonna pull back some so that you can see a couple more things I wanna show you before we do our 360s and all that stuff. So I wanted to show you, number one, this outfit here. 
And I want to show you, she does come on a made to move body, which is awesome. It means she can do like maximum posing, but it's not just any made to move body. It is the tall made to move body. So it's more, you know, inclined with the models. So very cool. Another thing I wanted to show you because I was being a little bit nosy earlier was I wanted to show you something back here. Now you can see, and I'm going to go in again. Now the the outfit uh, top and bottom, they're both with Velcro. No big deal to me. But look, when you remove this, yes, 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 yes. We have a bodysuit. And I am all in. I love when they have bodysuits included. with this. That way you don't have to worry about trying to tuck in a blouse or anything like that. It's just automatically done for you. So very cool. And I love that it gives you some versatility with the mix and matching options. But ah, stare into her eyes again. Isn't she gorgeous? So these are the accessories and the extra outfit pieces that come with Barbie Looks number 19. And I'm going to start in with the second pair of shoes. And you can see these are really nicely designed, easy to put on cute color will match really nicely you also get this purse here and i love that they have the little string there so it helps the doll hold the purse very cute she get the second purse and we've seen this purse before but it's a very nice touch with this outfit we also get these bracelets here very cute and i see that they have the opening there so it'll make it a little bit easier to put the bracelets on since made to move bodies the wrists cannot be uh, removed also we get this pair of uh what do they call these cat eye glasses super cute i love the colors that they got with it it's gonna go really well with actually the, the bonus outfit here and also the outfit that the doll comes with oh this is gonna be so much fun speaking of bonus pieces of course, these are the two pieces that you get. And of course, you can either put this together as one outfit or you can mix and match it with the other pieces that the doll is wearing. And it'll look fabulous either way, I believe. Also, we have a display stand so that your doll can be displayed nicely. Let's do a 360 of Barbie looks number 19 in her first look. So one of the first things I must say is that I'm so in love with the posability of the made to move body. It's so nice to be able to pose a Barbie properly. Oh, I'm so excited. So I wanted you to, of course, to see the outfit from all angles, but I'm going to go in and you can see I put her cat eye sunglasses on so you can see how they look on her. And they're very, very stylish. You can also see her dark hair, I'm absolutely loving it. And she's holding one of her clutch purses. Now I'm gonna go over here so that we can see some more of that face again. Of course, super cute. And of course, the bodysuit and the high-waisted tailored pant. And I'm just gonna scroll down so that you can see. And of course, those shoes, I love the design of this heel, so cool. Cool. I'm going to scroll up just a little bit more so that you can see some more of the detail of the pant. Very cool. This is such a sleek and cool look for this doll. Loving it. So while redressing this doll, I stumbled upon this. Look at this. Mattel put the little protective knee things like another company i know of that does that too now i'm not saying that they're biting and if they are biting good because obviously this is such a cool thing this goes to show that mattel is starting to pick up their um uh pace <laughs> and catching up so this is a really cool surprise to see now i gotta take them off <laughs> Let's do a 360 of Barbie looks number 19 in her second look. This is such a different look for this doll. And it's also, it's really weird because it fits in perfectly with the other outfit and pieces. 
it also fits in really nicely with the wave. So it's just ingenious to me. So anyway, let's go in and see, of course, that beautiful screening. I love how the glasses just kind of pop with the outfit. Her hair looks like she needs a little bit of a treatment. So I may need to give the back of her hair a little bit of a treatment. I'm going to be very careful because I don't want to touch those bangs at all. Those bangs are perfection. I'm going to scroll down so that you can see. I tucked the blouse into the skirt so that you could see the gold belt that's a part of the pencil skirt. Also, you can see she's got the bracelets on and she's also holding her purse. I'm going to go down so that you can see the shoes. And I absolutely love, okay, it looks like I pressed down a little bit too hard on the, her on the doll stand. So I'll need to lift her up just a little bit, but these shoes are absolutely gorgeous. And of course, I love the design of that purse. Super cute. And I'm going to go over here so that we can see a little bit more of Lena. Look at her. Ah, oh, just really beautiful and just such a really updated look for Barbie. I am really feeling really good about this Barbie looks line from what I've seen so far. And that is the second look of Barbie looks number 19, Lena. Let's welcome the Lena edition of our panel. First we have Barbie looks number one, Lena. Next we have PTMI Barbie, Lena. And last but never least, actress, model, singer, Alyssa Rodriguez. So panel, I wanted to get your thoughts on Barbie looks number 19, Lena. So Lena, I see that you have a note for me and you say, I'm so gorgeous and versatile. I should host my own show. Oh no, she did. <laughs> well, Lena, I must say you are very right. You are very, very versatile. And Lena, I see that you have a note for me. And you say, I'm so gorgeous and versatile, I should host this show. Oh no, she did. So what are your thoughts on Barbie looks number 19? <laughs> and you have a note for me, and you say... Who? <laughs> well, um, thank you, Pamela. <laughs> So Barbie looks number 19 is really well thought out. I think well executed, well designed. I mean, you name it, she is it. And I really, really love this doll. I love the mix and match possibilities. I love just even just putting this outfit together. Just really, really cool. So if you haven't gotten your hands on this doll, I suggest that you do. So if you like this video, and I hope that you did, then please make sure that you click the like button. That's how I know that you like my videos. And if you have not yet subscribed, then please make sure that you do that today. There's some button down there. You press that, then you hit notifications, and then you get notified of when I come up with new videos just like this one. So thanks again for watching, and I hope that you have a great day.